everybody and welcome to another episode of Angela Eats TV. Hey, it's Taco Tuesday, y'all. Yes, it is. It's Taco Tuesday. And what I have is some, uh, I made a couple of tostadas and I have a taco over here. Can you guys see this? Yum. And what I have on my tostadas and my tacos, I have the same ingredients on both, is I have some ground beef, I have some um, sweet corn, I have lettuce, refried beans, guacamole, sour cream, and I have some hot sauce, some black olives, and then I have some um, hot jalapenos over here on the side with some uh, spicy cucumbers over here on the side. And yes, I have some um, sour cream and to drink my trusted apple juice indeed okay so we're going to go ahead and say great it's taco tuesday started everybody father god in the name of jesus i want to thank you for this meal that i'm about to receive i ask that you let it be nourishing upon my body i ask that you bless those that do not have i ask that you just put your arms of protection around us and this i pray in jesus name amen amen and amen to you How's everybody doing today? Okay, this is hashtag Piggy Palette. Note to self, don't hurt yourself. I want to thank all my team members for coming back. Welcome back. For all my new team members, welcome to the team. And if you're just so happy to be watching this video and you are not a team member, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn that gray into red. It's totally free. Why not? All right, now. I'm hungry, y'all. So this is Taco Tuesday. What y'all having with me today, huh? I'm going to go ahead and take a bite. I think I want to toast. Oh, I want some sour cream. Hold on. This for all my sour cream lovers out there. I got to have me some sour cream. Yum. Yes, indeed. Got to have some sour cream today. So, woo, I waited for this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, when I know I'm finna be doing the get down with the get down and eating something messy why I do this I don't even understand mm 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 let me show y'all can y'all see that pause please forgive me Please forgive me. If you don't got a snack, go get you a snack and come right on back. Okay. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So I felt like tostadas. Mmm. 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 It is so good. I try to keep my mouth clean. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is so good. I went out today I got I got up about six this morning and I cooked I cooked my brother a meal my brother's getting ready to have a kidney transplant he's been in dialysis and um, 
also, I've been making it my business to take him home cooked meals every week. Every single Sunday, I get up early and I start prepping the night before so I could take my brother some meals. If, if you've been following me on my Instagram or you hit my community page, you can see a couple of meals that I have prepared for him. And I don't just fix one meal. I fix two different meals and give him a variety so he can eat it over the next couple of days. Mm-hmm. And I make sure that I prepare meals that's easy to reheat and it always tastes better the next day. What I prepare for him that day of to eat, that's what he that's what he eats that day. So when I take it to him, it's hot. And the dishes that are, are, are cold are the dishes that I prepared the night before. But per se, if I did spaghetti or lasagna or spinach, you know, um, chicken alfredo, I took him some of that beef wellington. I mean, that video isn't up yet, but it'll be coming up soon. Mm-hmm. Uh oh Mm-mm. That was a fumble, y'all. Mm-mm. I'm going to have to put something right there. So how's everybody doing? How was the weekend? Mine was pretty relaxing. You know, just preparing menus. Did a couple of cooking videos. Answering some emails. You know, and um, try to line some things up. Excuse me. Oh, yes. Oh, excuse me. That ain't even cute. Mm mm mm. Y'all see this taco? Please don't drop none. Y'all see that taco? Ooh, what is that? Get away from here. That ain't for you. Got a little gnat in here. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is so good. I love tacos. I imagine everybody loves tacos, huh? <laughs> mm -mm -mm. I got some spicy pickles in here. Mm -mm -mm. That is so full. Mm. That sour cream is so good. So, so, so good. But anyway, let me take another bite. Y'all see that? Mm. 
Mm-mm. 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 All these spices is just hitting all in the right places. Nothing lingering too far on the right palate or the left palate. Just right here in the middle of the tongue. Nothing too far in the back of the throat. It's just all around spiciness, goodness. But anyway, forgive me. Back to what I was saying. So, I have a brother. We're 11 months apart. Ooh, that ain't even cute. Excuse me. And. Ooh, excuse me. Ooh, ooh excuse me. Mm, mm, mm. That is not cute. Anyway. We're 11 months apart. And for seven days, we are exactly the same age. For seven days. <laughs> and um, he's been pretty sick. You know, um, type 2 diabetes. And um, he's in renal failure. But... Um, He's getting ready to, have, Lord say the same, he's getting ready to have a kidney transplant. And his son has tested to be a match, and he's willing to do it. Thank God, you know. But I'm making my business to cook my brother meals every single Sunday. Every Sunday. Cook him. Some of the beef wellington with the spinach, um, creamy Alfredo, um, pasta, and he loves my lasagna, so I made a, a nice little small thing of lasagna and took that to him. And fried him some um, chicken wings. And then I packed the bag with some paper plates. Made him some garlic rolls. Some garlic bread. And then I drive 30 minutes to go take it to one. Because I love it. You know what they say you give the people? They flowers. Ooh, excuse me. Y'all know what I'm finna say. Ain't nothing cute about it. Give people them give people their flowers while they are alive. And they can smell them and appreciate them. Mm-hmm. That was a spicy cucumber, y'all. Mm. But I haven't done a Taco Tuesday in a while. And I wanted to do a Taco Tuesday with you guys. I was lonely for you. And 
You're who I talk to. Tell you the truth. Woo, this is so good. Mmm. Mm hmm. So, so, so good. I'm trying to think what I'm going to do next for you guys. I don't know. I really want to do a restaurant review. Mm. But I'm kind of in the balance. I want to do one, but I just don't know which one I want to do. Now, I seen the Red Robins, Red Robins, and I haven't tried Shake Shack yet. And the reason that I'm holding off with with that one is because um, I've been in touch with someone, or someone's been in touch with me about us doing. Uh, Shake Shack uh, collab together, so we'll see how that pan out. Cause I'm not ex I'm not exactly sure what's going to happen with that, but I I am dying to try Shake Shacks because I love a good hamburger just like I love a good taco. Okay, I ain't even gonna play with you about it. But the reason I can I feel like I can hold out on it is because there's something that I wanna I've seen that I really want to try out at Red Robins, which is their vegan burger, um, or and uh, they got a, a shroom burger that I really want to try. And then um, they have them that comes into the in the lettuce wrap as well, and I want to try one like that as well. And there are certain places where I want to try the lettuce wrap. I don't want to try the lettuce wrap from Five Guys because every time I've seen it, it just falls apart. I don't want to try the lettuce wrap from In-N-Out because I don't like their french fries. So, we'll see how it pan out. But, um, and then I haven't done Jamaican food yet. And, there, and, and there's this um, uh, soul food restaurant called Shock Callers. Man, and and they've taken say uh, uh, soul food and um, infused it like they doing like they have like some green and macaroni and cheese egg rolls that kind of stuff. So I'm dying to get over there and go try that rest right now. And I know you guys would really really love to go see that um, to see that food review. Just, you know, to see what it, it's about or whatever. But I wanted to come and do a taco review with you guys because it's been so long since I've done one. And not to say that I have not been eating tacos. I have been eating tacos, okay? But I always be eating tacos at the wrong time. Or, you know, I'm just feeling ratchet and I, I just don't feel like turning the camera on, you know? Went out today. I went out today. Um, me and my roommate, we went out today and we went to um, Wally World, aka Walmart, and went in and out of there. And then we were going to go to Costco, but after standing in the line, at Walmart and they're right across from the next parking lot to each other so after standing in the line at Walmart to get checked out then we was gonna we just drove across the parking lot to go to uh, Costco and we seen that line I'm like girl it's starting all over again. So, you know, that, then I was like, I, if you want to go in, you can go in. But I'm, I'm sitting in the car. I'm sitting this one out. I'm full. 
You know what time it is. Yeah, you know what time it is. If you're happy and you know it, what you know about that? You can like me. You can hate me. You can love me. You can totally ignore me. But whatever you do, you introduce me to somebody. But before all that, you do you. Because I'm damn sure doing me. Boom. And to the next episode of Angela Eats TV, I'll see you at the next restaurant review. Maybe another mug bang. Maybe your story time. Who knows? It can be evolved. But until then, 